Hello everyone, this is Sophia. Welcome back to PT class. Today we're going to read another RA passage. Now let's get started. 各位同学大家好,欢迎大家来到PT class. 我们今天呢,接着来讲口语部分的RA. 首先呢,我们来看一段文本. Global warming is defined as an increase in the average temperature of the Earth's atmosphere. This trend began in the middle of the 20th century and is one of the major environmental concerns of scientists and governmental officials worldwide. The changes in temperature result mostly from the effect of increased concentrations of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. 接下来呢,我们来看一下第一句话. Global warming is defined as... 这里, global warming. 然后后面, is defined as... 这个地方的连读, defined as, 连到一块, as, defined as, 然后 as和后面这个案放到一块, defined as an increase, increase 变成 an increase, 然后 global warming is defined as an increase in the average temperature of the Earth's atmosphere. 然后注意一下这个th要发生变音,the,因为后面这里是一个原因素, the average, average temperature, 注意一下这个单词啊,很多同学读错, 这个单词的重音在前面, temperature, 那这个地方的话,自然就是弱读了, temperature, 或者说呢,甚至把这个音省掉叫 temperature, 但是很多同学会把它读成 temperature, 重音错了,整个单词呢就错了,就好比我们中文的这个一二三四声这个声调一样,一旦读错了就感觉怪怪的,非常明显。然后紧接着到后面这里的, the earth,这个th也发生变音,然后这个s,然后atmosphere,然后连读, in the average temperature of the earth's atmosphere, 注意下最后这个单词atmosphere, 重音的前面,这里是一个梅花音at, 然后这个弱化成一个atmosphere, 然后接下来到第二句, this train began in the middle of the 20th century, 到这里停顿一下, this trains began, began, 注意下这里, 它是一个梅花音, began, began, 不要读成began, gun, 它不是gun的这个音,是gan, gan, in the middle of the 20th century, in the middle, 和这个of连读, love, love, 20th century, 这个地方稍微有些难, 注意下这里的th呢, 是舌头伸出来, 然后后面这个century又是s, 舌头又进去, 所以说有些同学可能是猛的一下, 不是特别适应啊, 不知道该怎么去读, 一定要注意哈, 就是多练习, 熟能生巧, 等到舌头灵活了之后, 你会发现, 其实读起来还是很自然的, 然后紧接着到下面, and is one of the major environmental concerns, is one of, 这个one和of放在一块有一个nev, one of, 注意下这个of, 不要读成of,是nev, nev, one of, the major environmental concerns, 注意下这个单词, environmental, 然后后面 concerns, 注意下这里是a, can, concern, 不要读成concern, concerns of scientists and governmental officials worldwide, 注意下后面, scientists, 注意下sign, sign, 这里的, I, sign, 不要读成 sign, sign, scientist, 不对, scientists. 然后接下来, governmental, 注意下这结尾, 它是还有一个 AL, 不要漏掉了, 不要读成 government. 然后紧接着到后面这个单词, 很多同学会读成 official 或 official, 都不对, 这个单词呢, 重音在后面, 所以说前面是弱读了, uh, official, official, worldwide, 这个单词注意一下,这里有一个卷舌, 这里是 a的发音, world, world, l, 这个音, 不要读成 word, 然后紧接着到下面一句, the changes in temperature, the changes, 注意下 change, 后面加 yes, 读成 changes, the changes in temperature, result mostly from the fact of increased concentrations, result mostly from, result, 然后 effect, the effect of increased concentrations, increased, 然后后面 concentration, 注意下这里是 concentration, of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. Greenhouse, 注意下这个house, house, 嘴巴要张开, 不要读成house, 是不对的. Gases, 注意下gas, 后面加 es, gases. 然后紧接着到后面, in the atmosphere, 
，然后这里 t h e 要发生变音，这个单词重音在后面。那我们接下来呢，再来慢速的读一遍，大家注意一下这里面的发音细节。Global warming is defined as an increase in the average temperature of the Earth's atmosphere. This trend began in the middle of the 20th century and is one of the major environmental concerns of scientists and governmental officials worldwide. The changes in temperature result mostly from the effects of increased concentrations. Of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. 那接下来呢，我们再来长速的读一遍。Global warming is defined as an increase in the average temperature of the Earth's atmosphere. This trend began in the middle of the 20th century and is one of the major environmental concerns of scientists and governmental officials worldwide. The changes in temperature result mostly from the effects of increased concentrations. Of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. 那我们接下来呢，看一下这个词汇部分，注意一下这个 atmosphere， 注意一下，重音在前面，前面是一个梅花音。然后第二个 concentration。那我们今天的精讲部分呢，就讲完了。那么接下来呢，还需要大家呢大量去朗读，一定要跟读模仿，看到自己的哪些音读错了，反复去练习，熟能生巧，才能够真正记住这个单词。不然的话，哪怕你发现这个词读错了，那你过一会儿再去读还是错的。所以说，一定要大量练习。那么大家可以去智能纠音小程序里面去朗读。最主要的话就是模仿跟读，看自己的问题出在哪。那么大家可以关注公众号，通过公众号呢进入这个基金库或者说智能纠音小程序里面去学习。那么同时也可以及时关注最新消息。我们下节课见，拜拜喽。